Well, it's time for the children. We'll invite the youth and children to come forward. Good morning. <laughs> How are you? Good. Good? Good. All right. We're going to start with our Bible verse first. Okay, so you can help me read. Do, Do not, not conform, conform to the, to pattern, the pattern of, of the this world. world. But, but be, be transformed, transformed by the, the renewing, renewing of your mind. mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, his good and perfect will. Romans 12, 2. All right. So in Romans 12, 2, our verse that we just read, it tells us that we shouldn't think the same things that the world thinks, that we need to change the way that we think. And many think, people think about being streetwise or worldly wise, and you think about the world things. But God wants us to think about the way he thinks. He wants us to renew our mind. Right, here is our glass. Here's our glass. And we are going to think that this is our mind. So we're going to start with filling it with worldly things. And some of those things are not bad, but some of them, like lying and cheating and not being nice, that happens. And our minds can be filled with worldly things. You think I'm going to pour in the water? Did you read my paper, Carter? I can tell by the way you have that You can tell? You can tell? All right, so our... Hi, Leo, come on in. So our... That's okay. You're, we're welcome to come anytime. So our, right now, our mind is full of worldly things. But God wants us to change that, so I need your help. Okay, we're going to look at this and see if we can get it to change by looking at it. All right, so we're going to look at it for like 30 seconds. All right, everybody look really hard. <laughs> is anything happening? No, nothing is happening. Okay, so... We, need, we do need some help to make some changes. So this is going to be God's word. What is God's word? Um, um, the Holy Spirit. It's something we read. The Bible. the Bible. right? So God wants us to fill our minds with the Bible. Right, so keep watching. Keep watching. Keep watching. It is overflowing. But I want you to keep watching because we're changing. Yeah, we're changing our mindset. We're changing what we're filling our minds with. The water's going to be empty. That's okay. It's okay. The pan, my pan is leaking. Oh, well, that's all right. That's why it's on this. All right, so let's look. <laughs> Thanks, Carter. That's okay. So our picture was God's Word, and it's filling us with the Bible instead of the worldly thoughts. All right? What do you notice about the way that the glass looks compared to the way it did? What, how does it look different? It's a weird color. All right, does it look like milk anymore? Yeah, it, it, it would taste weird if someone were to drink it. Yeah, it would be less than like 2%, huh? So it wouldn't, wouldn't t taste the best. But does it look the same color as the milk? No. No, it does not. It All looks right. Like a yep, it kind of does. But we've washed away. We've washed away. We've changed. So pretty much, what's it filled with now? Milk. Mostly what, though, now? And what did we say the water was? The Bible. the Bible. Good job, Leo. You are right. So our <laughs> mind has been changed or transformed and now filled with the Bible. That is correctly. That is correct. So the more that we let God's word in, the more it cleans us up 
and helps us to think that the way God wants us to. Sometimes the bad stuff kind of comes back in, so it's still a little cloudy. But we keep adding more, and it keeps changing. And you're right, Carter, we really have a big leak, so we'll have clean up aisle five. That's okay. Well, no, we don't, want, we don't want to pour milk back in it. We want it to be all clear because we want it to be filled with God's word. We want our mind and heart to be filled with God's word. Well, we can just dump the substance out and then just put water in. We could, and that's, that's what Jesus did for us, Carter. He took away all the bad so we could be with God. All right, let's say a little prayer. Dear God. Dear God. Thank you. Thank you. For sending us your word. For sending us your word. And helping us. And helping us. To change. To change. Our mind. Our minds. So it can focus. So it can focus. On your word. On your word. Your will. Your will. And your love. And your love. Through Jesus. Through Jesus. And all God's people said. Amen. Amen. Thank you guys.